Hey guys, it's Eva here, and if you click on this video because you want to find out how to back up your camera roll on Snapchat, I've got you covered, so let's just get into it. As we all know, Snapchat has a unique feature that no other social media app offers. One of the handiest features of Snapchat is that it automatically saves all snaps and stories to your memories which are stored in the cloud and are available for sharing with friends and family at all times. Apart from this, you can also back up photos from your camera roll to your Snapchat memories. So if you're running low on storage space on your phone, you may want to clear out your camera roll from time to time, right? So in a nutshell, you can add images saved to your camera roll to the snaps folder and memories. It's pretty simple. You can export them as a story and then save the story instead of sharing it on Snapchat. If this sounded confusing, to you and you don't know how to do it, keep on watching. If you're using an Android phone, this is what you'll have to do. Open the Snapchat app on your phone and on the camera screen, tap on the gallery icon to the left of the shutter button. You go to the camera roll tab at the top of the memory screen. Although you can see photos from your camera roll and memories, you'll notice a message at the top saying your camera roll isn't backed up by Snapchat. You tap and hold the image or images you want to back up to Snapchat memories and you'll see a menu appear at the bottom of the screen. This will display the selected images as though you're going to post them as a story, but don't worry, they won't be shared publicly. After that, you tap on save at the bottom of the screen and you select save to memories. This backs up the selected photos to the snaps folder in your memories. After saving the pictures, go to the snaps tab in memories to see your backed up images. So all images saved to the Snaps folder are automatically backed up to Snapchat. So even if you delete and reinstall Snapchat, the images will remain in this folder. If you have an iPhone, the steps are more or less the same with a few minor differences in the options. You'll find all the information about this in our article. Uh, I'll link it down below. So check that out. Um, if you guys have any questions, of course, comment down below. And yeah, if you if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And I'll thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.